In the working class Mexico City neighborhood of Iztapalapa, dissident public teachers of the CNTE and parents organize a day of cultural activities, workshops for youth, and lectures on people's history. They say this is the kind of education they seek to defend and that is in jeopardy from the government's education reform. We believe that the government generally seeks to reduce to a minimum cultural education that is given to the population. For over three years, both the teachers and the families that support them have rejected the reform. They say it seeks to privatize public education and strip teachers of their hard-won labor rights. One father argues that the reform seeks to do away with critical thinking altogether. We know perfectly well that what they seek to do is that our children be taught to be workers that are paid little, ignorant and docile. While the CNTE Teachers Union builds support in the neighborhoods, it constantly pressures the authorities from the streets. Although there are ongoing negotiations, the teachers denounce what they say is a government-sponsored media smear campaign directed against them. Ultimately, they argue their actions go beyond their own personal or collective interests. This is not just the struggle of us teachers. Rather, this is the people's struggle for the good of free education so that this is always available to youth. It is expected that further negotiations between the teachers, interior ministry and public education officials will carry on through next week. Meanwhile, the CNTE says its actions will continue until the reform is revoked. Clayton Cantalazur, Mexico City.